Qatar's Amir Sheikh Tamim delivers a powerful speech at the opening of the LDC5 conference in Doha. Qatar condemns a provocative Israeli comment that calls for the erasing of a Palestinian town. Qatar charity hopes to drive up the number of sponsored orphans ahead of Ramadan. And finally, Lionel Messi is reportedly unhappy with his contract renewal offer. Hi, it's Ali. This is The Roundup. Here are today's top stories. Qatar's Emir Sheikh Tamim bin Hamad Al Thani urged wealthy nations to step up to their responsibility of assisting least developed countries during the UN's fifth LDC conference in Doha. Earlier today, the Emir announced a $60 million contribution that will go towards implementing the Doha program of action and help least developed countries worldwide. The Emir also slammed the politicization of aid delivery to Syria in the aftermath of the earthquakes, stressing against the exploitation of the tragedy for political purposes. The historic LDC 5 is being held in Doha for the first time and will see thousands come together to address the most pressing issues. Now, Qatar's Ministry of Foreign Affairs has condemned in the strongest terms an Israeli minister's comment to quote, wipe out a Palestinian town. The remarks were made by Israeli Finance Minister Bezlal Smotrich just days after Jewish settlers rampaged the historic town. In a statement, Qatar described the comments as a war crime, while Israel's main allies in Washington called it repugnant and irresponsible. Now, Qatar charity is rallying to pump up support for its Rufaqa initiative. The charity is keen on seeking more help from people in Qatar to sponsor the largest number of orphans before Ramadan kicks off later this month. Qatar charity says it wants to help 200,000 orphans and underprivileged children as part of its campaign. For more on how you can help, head over to our website. And finally, in somewhat stunning news, World Cup winner Lionel Messi has reportedly rejected an initial contract renewal by Paris Saint-Germain. While details are not public, reports say Messi rejected the contract due to a lower salary. Messi currently earns 35 million euros net per season, including add-ons and bonuses. However, PSG is under pressure to cut costs. It remains to be seen how this saga drags on, with Messi's contract set to expire in June this year. Thank you for joining us. For more of our stories, head over to our website www.dohanews.co. Have a great day.